cool going backwards? Three, go. Like you hold on to the zip line, right? But you don't know exactly what's gonna what it's gonna feel like on the way. I almost could see it as like a parallel for my trip here. Going to Guatemala, it's gonna be like this, but I didn't know what it would actually feel like. Did you let go? <laughs> Did you let go? In 2006, a group of students from Bellevue Community College traveled to Guatemala to learn about fair trade coffee and to see another country and culture. The International Business and Exploration Club and BCC Student Programs sponsored this trip to help further these students' education in international business as well as to empower them to become better world citizens. Development is a complicated, messy business because it's, it's not clean. First of all, it's working with people. Uh, and then secondly... Through an internship program, these business students will be operating one of the coffee stands at BCC to apply what they're learning about running a business. For part of their trip, the students lived at Santa Anita, the residents of Santa Anita are striving to create a sustainable and profitable future by growing organic coffee and bananas on their communal farm. Through hands-on experience, the students learned what it takes to grow organic coffee. Here, we need, we've got one group that's going to be doing compost, we've got one group that's going to be digging the holes, and we've got one group that's going to be bringing in some of the dirt that we're going to use for the holes. I thought we were going to be doing some of the other trips, kind of a touristy kind of activity, but I like this. And again, I wouldn't trade this for anything. This is, this is a good experience. I always knew there was something behind the coffee and everything, but man, there's a huge difference between the pub and the reality. I mean, you know that you know there are people behind working to gather the coffee, to harvest and everything, but you gotta do it to really like appreciate it. I don't think you need to go near as deep as that. The students were able to see more of this beautiful country, its people, and its customs. The students learned about fair trade coffee, but by traveling abroad, they learned much more. Wherever you are at, you, your knowledge of the world is somewhat limited to what the media tells you. Kind of, you, we kind of live a sheltered life if we just stay in our home country. So they're very grateful for you know these things because they're for the kids. Their eyes were not only open to another culture, but they also gained new perspectives on their own lives. I have always thought that money is like happiness, but ah, wrong. This simple life is like so flavorful, so cool. I want to, I want to have this. One thing I realized last night is that there's so many different perspectives on life than just mine. I learned a lot about myself. I learned a lot about other people, and mostly I learned that the world doesn't revolve around me. I think I have changed um, over time what what I value in life. You know, it used to be that all I wanted was to succeed in the business world and, you know, to get a good paying job. And now I'm like, well, why do I need to do that? Why, why can't I do a job that benefits a third world country? Why can't I do a job that, that benefits people half around the world? It's really inspirational coming down here. I know I, I keep saying that, but um, 
as you come down you see what you it makes you appreciate what you actually have back in the states a lot and it kind of makes you i in a way i feel almost foolish the things that i even as a the, the day before i left complaining about oh i don't have enough socks it's like i'm watching these kids run around and play soccer barefoot no socks nothing it just puts everything in perspective this trip to Guatemala is an excellent example of one of the ways that BCC is working to help students learn valuable skills for life. This trip not only gave them a better understanding of the coffee they will be selling, but also a new perspective of the world. The families in Santa Anita and the others who these students have met have touched their lives in a special way. The students will forever carry this experience and the memories of their new friends with them.